shit. Why don't you tell that story? No. No, of course. I tell that story. Okay, one time I was on the summit ridge, and my rope between the two climbers, me and my other partner, went up in the air and back down to him because we're because the wind was so strong. And I was too scared to take a picture. It would have been an awesome picture. Uh, the road, rope was going straight up, huh? Well, it was going up on a curve back down to him. Yeah. There's the shadow of the mountain, and we can see the plume of the snow being ripped off the top of the summit in the shadow. So it must be howling up there. So we uh, we didn't bring our hustle today. So uh, we're it's a good thing we're turning around. Did you did you did you bring in, did you bring any hustle? No, I left it at home. You left? Damn it! I know I got this full pack. I, I told you, I told you to bring the hustle today. Now we neither one of us have any. Dang it! You could have hauled my ass up there. I know. Anyway, we're uh, there's illumination rock, and there's stuff falling off that thing. That's really crazy. Anyway, we're uh, getting back over the ridge, and I got my eyes climbing in for today. Uh, about two steps <laughs> with with an ice axe, no tools. It was on the down climb it was even freakier. Rick said he ran over that. He didn't run. He turned around and front pointed. Yeah, I'm leaving a stain here. Anyway, uh, we're heading out. Five men out. Goodbye, Rick. Bye, Rick.